Hi there, Jordy Christo here with homesteadusers.com and also homesteadwebsitebuilder.com is our new blog. I want to talk to you today about this message that you will get sometimes when you're trying to log into the Site Builder program. If you haven't gotten it yet, eventually you will. I want you to understand what it means and what you should do with it. First off, we need to understand that when we download the Site Builder program, that that gets stored on our local personal computer. And as we are building our website pages with the Site Builder, that they're being remembered and stored on our local personal computer. When we publish our pages, they get stored in the Homestead Intuit Hosting Center. So, when we get this message and it says the local and published versions of the file are different, both files have changed. What that means is that Homestead is seeing something different on their file server than what they are seeing on your computer whenever you're trying to log into your Site Builder program. So, they want to know whether you want to use the copy that they have stored on their server, if you want to use the copy that's stored in your computer on the Site Builder program. So let's take a look at this, and I'll give you an example. I'm going to click on View the Published Copy. We're going to take a look at what Homestead is seeing for this particular page, and then we'll take a look at what is on my Site Builder um, program on my personal computer. Okay, here we go. Now, we've seen that page. I just want you to look at this area right here because that's where the page is going to look different on my personal computer. Now I'm going to view the local copy. And the lo now you can see here it says this page is stored on my computer. That's the difference. Um, I added that little section of text with the yellow. I added it after I published the other page. And then I kept working in the Site Builder, and I added that particular block of text. And then I clicked on Save, but I never published the page. So that's why Homestead is saying, hey, we're seeing a couple different things happening here. Which one do you actually want to use? So if we go back here, if I chose to download the published copy, what that would do is that would download the published copy from the Homestead saved version, it would download it to my Site Builder version on my personal computer. So you want to make sure that you make the right choice here because if you're actually working on your Site Builder page and you saved it, and, the, and what you saved is actually what you want to keep, if you click on Download Published Copy, it's going to change the version that you have right here, which is Keep Your Local Copy. Okay, that's my video tutorial for today. Make sure you rate my videos and subscribe to my videos and get over to the homesteadusers.com and homesteadwebsitebuilder.com because we have great tutorials and information that will help you. Okay, I'm Jordy Christo. Have a great day.